In this video, we are analyzing five years paper. Based on this analysis, you will come to know how many number of questions are appeared in particular year and particular chapter. As well as you will come to know how many number of questions can appear in 2024 KCT exam and accordingly you give the time and effort required for that chapter. Hello everybody, welcome to Diksha Karnataka. I am Jyoti Sandeep Mathematics Faculty. As we all know, first year will have less weightage compared to second PUC. But you cannot neglect the first year topics because those are the very fundamental which will take you to the second year topics. Okay. So, coming to this analysis chapter wise one by one, first year's chapters are like this in the chapter sets. See comparatively it is less in 2023, only one question because the chapter is a long chapter comparatively but only one question will come in that and relation and function part 1 that is the first year topic the same chapter you have in second PUC also there we can expect three questions in this first year topic we are having two question in an average if I see two only in that correct third chapter is the trigonometric functions very very important actually this chapter will give you a good hold for the differentiation and integration chapter so don't forget or don't neglect this chapter okay you have to recall all the concepts what you have in this trigonometric and I know that only one question it has see comparatively it has reduced because concept they have deleted so this video we are making on the deleted part right 2023 is a recent one so you have to take that analysis more so in 2022 I know that four questions were there but now only one the huge chapter but only one question even though you cannot leave this chapter okay principle of mathematical induction chapter is taken off consistently from 2021 we don't have the questions even this year the chapter is deleted so don't worry about that chapter next is complex numbers and quadratic equations even though it is a huge chapter only one question you have in that so there you see if the time is not permitting you for complex numbers you can neglect that because the continuity of that chapter is not there for your second PUC okay linear inequality also the same case only one question we are having in this permutation and combination knowledge is important because probability depends on this permutation combination so it doesn't matter one question or two question chapter is important so go through that once it's very easy and as I told one question in that chapter binomial theorem it is depending on the permutation combination okay continuity of the chapter permutation and combination and we can expect one question from that consistently if you see it has only one or two questions in entire binomial theorem chapter and in that also middle term general term coefficients are the area where you can stress on so next chapter is sequence and series the large chapter and a very easy chapter in and average two questions that two we have two concepts in that ap and gp next is very huge very important topic that is a straight lines straight lines has a lot of uh, concepts involved in that even though only one question will appear from that particular chapter conic section and first PUC topic in that you have circles parabola ellipse and hyperbola but if you see the analysis only one question will appear in from that chapter and introduction of three dimensional geometry is nothing in the first PUC it has a good weightage in the second year okay first PUC concept hardly something distance formula and section is there so you just you can ne neglect that first PUC in a three dimensional geometry chapter this limit is important derivatives will be there in the second PUC but limits chapter will be there in the first PUC you will definitely get two three questions okay average I can tell two questions in from this chapter mathematical induction is a chapter which is taken off this year this is not there yes one question was there in the previous year this year it is taken off deleted from your portions statistics statistics is a large chapter but one question will appear from that probability continued part you have in second year probability one where you have the, all the basic sample space all that basic problems in that classical probability what we call one question will be there 
and continued part will be there in the second PUC. So till here what you are seeing all are first PUC chapters go through that once if you want. These are all what I told now these are a first year PUC chapters and uh, I do not have to repeat that first year chapters has a less weightage compared to your second year and in second year which are the most weightage ones I will tell you that later after the analysis. Now you see the second part of this relation and function second year chapter three questions average if you keep also two or three okay approximately three questions past year if you see 2023 we have three questions in that and as I told first PUC will have two questions. So in and average four to five we can keep inverse trigonometry is a continued part of a trigonometry functions what we saw in inverse trigonometric function pakka we will get a two questions okay for sure we will get two questions consistently they are asking that every year matrices and determinants you can take it as a one chapter or you can split it as a different different chapter because entire concept of matrices is involved in determinants. So together if I tell you the analysis see together if you see 6 to 7 they have given and previous year 6 questions has come from that chapter that means that is important. So one chapter though you know now which is the most important in second PUC that is matrices and determinants relation and function five questions together first year and second year this is the most important one continuity and differentiability you cannot neglect this okay if you neglect this integration will go off so together you have here six and here six right so that is a continued part of a differentiation in differentiation we have six every year if you see weightage is more in that chapter next chapter is application of the same differentiation that is application of derivatives so definitely you will get four questions last year you have got four three to four average we can keep for this year 2024 voila. integration is the second highest equal to your differentiation integration will also have a highest weightage you see any year you see any year it has a highest weightage okay so this year 2023 we have six questions from the chapter it is a huge actually if you see the weightage application of integration two questions pakka in the finding area and all so two definite questions will be there differential equations differential equation is application only that all that is together integral calculus so if I total this so we have 10 question from this part integral calculus and if I take the sum of this here we have 10 right. So at the end you will come to know which are the chapters where I have to give all the effort all the time required for that chapter right randomly do not open and sit with any chapter you should start with the chapters which has a more weightage okay that demands that much effort that demands that much time and you have to give that much time to get a better ranking okay let us see the next one which has a more weightage vectors and three dimension they are connected they are connected and I will take you together only I will take the count because vector and three dimension is a continued part of that together if I see average 2023 it is coming 9 average if I see it is coming like a 7 to 9 right so that is having a more weightage linear programming hardly anything they will give so it is a small portion also to know hardly one or two questions will be there in that that is not that important probability as I told in the previous one first PUC one question second PUC you have two questions so average three to four questions we can expect right 2023 they have asked two questions but if you go behind that 22 we have four questions here so that is why average we keep it as a three to four questions. So this is about all the chapters now roughly you have an idea which are the most important chapter as I have given you already one is this continuity and differentiability which is giving me all these are approximation only correct approximately 10 questions integral calculus approximately 10 questions two chapter to pakka you have to study this third one will be vectors and three dimension they are connected so that is a third one which has a nine mark in that 
and we have matrices and determinants together only I will take account 6 questions. 6 questions here and you have seen that previous one ok. Apart from that if I tell you the probability is important right. Now after seeing this table after seeing this analysis you will have a enough idea from where you have to start with right. Start with the, this chapters which I am showing here. Start with your differentiation, integration, vectors, three dimensional relations and functions, matrix and determinants. That should be in your, uh, that, that is your strength. Okay. After this, if time permits, then definitely go with the, all the chapters. So that's all in this video. I hope this will benefit you. I hope this will be helpful for your preparation. So kindly like, subscribe and share with all your friends. I want everyone to make use of this. Thank you. See you again.